You feel like you've completely fallen apart. The life you used to have. The person you used to be. What would people at work think of you if they could see you like this? Blubbering, a blubbering mess. Lost, confused, not having any sense of solidity. Who am I not having an answer? Discovering this like you'd been obliterated, had literally been killed, destroyed. The life you used to live, the person you used to be, the way you used to be, confident and self-assured, more self-assured. So you see what's driving you, and you have a choice, Dr. G says. You see your implicit assumptions, your beliefs in the world, the things which are motivating your behavior, driving your behavior, and now you can choose. Do you want to believe in them? Do you want to listen to them? Do they make sense? You can question them, and then, if you want to live differently, if they don't make sense to you, if you see that people truly aren't to be feared, if you see that you will be better, you will have a better life if you let people into your life, you can then choose to go against your fears, go against your beliefs, move forward, even with the awareness of how tenuous and fragile this life can be. Move forward with even more appreciation of how precious it is. Precious, fragile and precious and meant to be cherished and not taken for granted. You are weeping, nodding your head, bawling, your gut contracting, tears flowing away, your breath coming in huffs, all uneven. What are you going to choose, Thomas? What are you going to choose?